Both Microsoft and Sony have now announced the titles that they will be giving away for free as part of their subscription services, Games with Gold and PlayStation Plus respectively, so now is a great time to see which offering is the better of the two. Now, instead of deciding which is better through personal preference or bias, I will use statistics to set apart the two services. The three categories I'll analyse will be monetary value, critical reception and age. Tell me what you think of the two offerings below and if you want to see more videos like this, make sure to like this video. First up is monetary value. As PlayStation Plus has two more games than games with gold, they should always be expected to win this section, although there have been exceptions in the past. In total, the six titles for January add up to just under $105, which is significantly more than the yearly subscription cost of $50. If you're wondering where I got these prices from, I got them from the PlayStation Store. Games with Gold is not quite as valuable as PlayStation Plus this month, as the grand total comes to a little less than $90, which is still quite a lot of cash for just four titles. Therefore, the winner of this round is PlayStation Plus. Next up is Critical Reception. PlayStation Plus originally had a rule of only giving away games which are rated 70 or above on Metacritic, and this month they decided to go against the rule and include Medal of Honor Warfighter, which has a Metacritic score of 55. Medal of Honor basically cancels out the high score of Dragon Age Origins and lowers the overall average of the month to 74.8. Games with Gold is more consistent than its Sony counterpart and does not feature any extreme outliers. Therefore, the overall Metacritic average fares better at 78. For the record, the scores of the new releases of Hardware Rivals and Zeros are not available yet and therefore are absent from the calculations. With the highest score, this round goes to Games with Gold. The final round is Age. PlayStation Plus has a mixture of old and new in January. While Hardware Rivals is a brand new game, meanwhile Grim Fandango and Nihilumbra both released last year, the other titles are pretty old. Dragon Age Origins is the oldest by far, releasing all the way back in 2009. Games with Gold also features a brand new title in the form of Zeros, but the other titles are a little dated, releasing in 2011, 2012 and 2013 respectively. Overall, Games with Gold just about scrapes this category and also manages to be the better service for the month of January, so well done Microsoft. Which service do you like more? Whatever you think, let me know in the comments. And for more video game videos, make sure to subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.